hi welcome back to Rebecca's Travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel hi welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle hi how are you all doing I hope everybody's as well as possible um, today I'm going to be doing a budget travel news special 10 exciting facts um, October 2023 um, part 2 and this is according to budgettravel.com where I'm getting the information. Um, I may have mentioned, well I will have mentioned quite a few of these uh, facts before. But I have got um, a few new, new ideas um, have come up on budgettravel.com. And if you're new here to my channel, uh, please subscribe and um a big thumbs up and thank you for doing so i really appreciate it and anyway i'm going to jump right into the first fabulous fact uh, which is number one um a reasonable price hotel room do do your research ask questions um in your mind how close uh, will they be to um, a city or a place's major sites or attractions make sure a good price does not include a time wasting long distance uh, where you have to pay for transport or you're using your own fuel yourself um, if you're in driving in the same country going on holiday and driving in the same country that you're visiting um, but again if you can just walk to a place and it's just going to save you time and money um, Um, basically call the hotel and ask for their best price or call the accommodation where where you're wanting to stay and ask for the be uh, best price and uh, the most appropriate room option and um, if there's a free upgrade um, hotel tonight and um, it's for last minute deals and um, people that just want to hotel at the last minute um, and go on holiday at the last minute um, it could go on to hotel tonight number two the best day for airfare tickets buy your, your airline tickets about two months uh, before you uh, fly and book early in the week like Monday Tuesday um, when the airlines often are adjusting their f f fares and and make sure on social media you follow all major airlines and on so social media I try to um, follow the airlines and um, holiday companies as well as other ha holiday travels and um, also sign up for their rewards programs and subscribe to their uh, free e newsletter uh, to get inside track on deals uh, where they are um, so again especially if you tra uh, travel quite a lot um, in a year or, or especially if you travel with the same company then it's worth asking them if they have a reward scheme um, where you can save money or get free upgrades etc and um, number three uh, pick your rock rental car early rather than come last minute and uh, number four book your cruise either early or late so early you can get really good deals and 
if you book it late then you can get really good deals but if you book it late then you're not going to have um a, a basically or the same with booking anything late you've not got as much choice as um, if you book early number five uh, know your resort fee so if you think a resort fee, it fee is too much um, then again choose another resort and number six check out vacation rentals consider the size of your party a rental um, to have comf uh, that is comfortable to sleep um, or say if you've got a party of five um, which vacation rentals um, or accommodation is best to sleep a family of five and normally holiday rentals include a full kitchen and it's going to be more comfortable um, and you're much likely again to save on food and then say booking room only in a hotel uh, where you'd have to pay, uh, pay extra for food um, and, uh, unless the food is t uh, cheap while you're out there then again um so you've just got to look at look at it um is the food going to be cheap um to buy um where you're going to be traveling to or is again the hotel um with like all it inclusive or half board going to be the better option um, but if you're looking to uh, for five or more then you're in hotels you may have to book like a couple of rooms which will add up or if you uh, went into a hot holiday rental then again or self-catering it may work out cheaper um, for um, large uh, larger amounts of people um, or larger groups um, number seven public transport is your friend if you do not uh, live in a major city um, so long as you can learn the bus or train or underground metro um, routes tram routes then again, then again Um, or tram routes inside a city or a London underground inside the city then you can get to um, di at different places easily and uh, cheaply than if you were to hire a taxi um, etc and again it could be even cheaper than going by car because again fuel adds up um, these days as well at number eight um, a lot of museums are free uh, to go in so check if you need to pay to go in the mu at museum um, so that goes with museums and art galleries sometimes they are free sometimes you have to pay and don't forget if you do have to pay can you get a discount ask if you can get a discount and um, number nine uh, go to national or state parks um, and national and state parks are free to go to so if you're looking for a place to go to then um, a park uh, where you don't have to pay um, is one of them and uh, number 10 last but not least look for package deals because package deals again uh, can be uh, cheaper uh, than booking the hotel 
and flight um, individually so and um, I would like to say thank you for watching and bye for now and I'll see you tomorrow for my travel and lifestyle channels improvements updates and more so I hope you have a nice day and night wherever you are in the world thank you and bye for now thank you bye